To service the touch panel kit, first remove the touch mat, the right rear cover, the left rear cover, the column assembly, the bottom rear cover, the motherboard EMI shield, and the top rear cover. Partially remove the microphone assembly and the webcam assembly. Partially remove the right I.O. board and the left I.O. board. Free the panel backlight connector from its cable guides on the middle frame and detach the backlight connector from the touch panel. Squeeze the sides of the LVDS connector from the touch panel via the access hole near the system blower to detach the LVDS connector from the panel. Remove the 16 Torx head screws that secure the middle frame to the touch panel kit. 12 of these screws will be black self-tapping screws and 4 will be pink machine screws. Each screw location is marked with a stencil of an arrow with a single circle inside. Do not remove pink screws at a location that has a stencil of an arrow with two circles inside. Remove the speaker's interconnector from its cable guide on the front bezel. Partially tip up the bottom of the middle frame. Carefully remove the connector from the touch control board on the back of the panel before fully removing the middle frame from the touch panel assembly. The touch panel kit consists of the panel with front bezel attached and the touch control boards with their flat ribbon connector. To replace the touch panel kit, place the touch panel assembly face down on a soft flat surface. Align the top of the middle frame assembly over the touch panel. Connect the touch control board connector to the board before fully lowering the middle frame assembly into place. Tuck the speaker's interconnector into its cable guide on the front bezel. Secure the touch panel kit to the middle frame with 16 Torx head screws. 12 screws are black self-tapping screws, and 4 are pink machine screws. Each screw location is marked with a stencil of an arrow with a single circle inside. Replace the LVDS connector to the panel. Replace the backlight connector to the panel. And secure the backlight connector into its cable guides on the middle frame. Make sure the backlight connector is inserted into the port on the board that matches the LCD panel manufacturer. A stencil next to each port indicates the location per panel manufacturer. Set the jumpers on the board to match the configuration for the panel manufacturer. The jumper configuration for each panel manufacturer is stenciled on the board itself as well as on the middle frame right above the board. Replace the left I.O. board the right I.O. board the webcam assembly and the microphone assembly.